Hello guys, welcome back to Let's Talk Engineering, and today I will be talking about Taiwan, um, mostly about how Taiwan to China conflict can lead to a semiconductor shortage in the world. It is because that Taiwan manufactures around 50% of the world's semiconductors, so the conflict between Ch Taiwan and China could have massive effects on the world's economy. And the tension has been risen due to Nancy Pelosi's visit to Taiwan. The China has warned against her visit to Taiwan, and you know they're gonna take measures against it. But I don't think China will do anything about it because about because you know what's happened in Russia. They have been sanctioned, and you know its economy is basically going downhill, and it's gonna happen to China. If a war breaks out between the two countries, and in addition, the Taiwanese chip industries has economic leverage because you know how how important semiconductors is around the world, from our phones to laptops to tablets and even our cars. So if there's a chip shortage around the world, it will hurt China. And it might prevent China from escalating tensions any further. And um, you know, sanctions as well, besides hurting their own economy. So, um, U.S. and other countries like in Europe has been boasting their own domestic chip industries just in case if a war happened between the two countries. So, for example. The U.S. has passed a fifty-two billion bill, which will help Intel and the Taiwanese manufacturing company, the Taiwanese Semiconductor Manufacturing Corporation, to boost their manufacturing processes in the U.S. So, th so if a war break out between the two countries, they will still be able to produce chips in the U.S. So. I personally, I don't think that there will be a war between two countries because it will be too economic and humanitarian, humanitarily dangerous for two countries. It would destroy our economy because the U.S. won't be able to produce the amount of supplies we need, and China won't be able to have the luxury brands that the people want. They want to have a good life, and without these products. And with its cheap、um, domestic products and supplies, they won't be satisfied with it. Just to look at its housing industry; it's been doing great. So,、um, I don't think there'll be war between two countries because you know it's gonna kill a lot of people, and they're gonna they're gonna have a lot of destruction. And even if they do invade, it doesn't mean that the Taiwanese people won't resist. Which will cause a lot of civilian lives to be lost. So, if a war does happen between two countries, it can have devastating effects on the world if we aren't prepared, like the semiconductor shortages I've talked about. But you also have to think about the humanitarian issues, like refugees and, you know, people fleeing from the country. So. Thank you for watching the video, and if you enjoyed, make sure to like and subscribe. Peace out.